And when I met Frederick, small thing, he had a girlfriend. But then I looked at his future and I said, this guy is going to make it. Peggy stay. And to tomorrow, Frederick asked me. Netizens dragged Peggy Ovire for admitting that Frederick Leonard had other women while in the relationship with her for seven years. Guys, this is coming shortly after their wedding, where Peggy Ovire gave a lengthy, lengthy speech about Frederick Leonard and their relationship, how they started, how they met, and several ordeals that went on in the relationship. But what caught the attention of most netizens on social media? was when Peggy Ovire openly admitted that yes, Frederick Leonard had other women in the seven years of the relationship. Guys, I must tell you that I am also shocked and surprised by this statement. And a lot of netizens on social media are not even taking this matter lightly at all. As they see it as a major red flag in Frederick Leonard that Peggy Ovire should um, avoid. But then again, she went further into the marriage with Frederick Leonard. And this has got a whole lot of tongues on social media wagging, wagging as to why Peggy Ovira would still settle for Frederick Leonard. Or could it be that really nobody was coming for her and she just had no other choice than to accept a man who in the seven years of the relationship had other women. Guys, I must tell you for a fact that I'm also amazed and surprised by the statements of netizens on social media. I mean, this is a very blissful union. We are all happy for Frederick. We are happy for Peggy. But then again, why start this blissful um, union with your, you know, very critical analysis? Guys, this is not nice of some netizens. But I will not also deny the fact that there may be some sense in what they have said. But then again, I strongly believe that people change. And I think there is hope for Frederick Leonard and Peggy Ovire. Well, guys, if I even go deeper to show you the video right now, I just want to be sure that you are doing okay and if this is your very first time of stumbling on this channel you are highly welcome to g central your number one blog for the latest and trendiest news on the internet all i need you to do for me right now is to kindly subscribe to this channel g central and also turn on your post notification by smashing the bell button down below so you'll be one of the very first persons to see our next post and to my all-time subscribers thank you so so much for sticking with g central for always watching our videos for your likes your comments and most especially for sharing our videos on your facebook groups i see all of that and i am super grateful now guys let's go over to this very spicy gist hmm I must tell you for a fact that I am also surprised at the way a lot of persons see certain things. So Peggy Ovire made a statement that shook a lot of persons on social media. I'm going to be playing the video for you right now. When I met Frederick, small thing, he had a girlfriend. But then I looked at his future and I said, this guy is going to make it. Peggy stay. And to tomorrow, Frederick asked me. So here, yeah, this was what Peggy Ovire said during um her long and lengthy love you know story with peggy um frederick leonard i mean and this got a lot of attention it's really attracted a whole lot of netizens on social media as to why a woman would want to settle for a man who had other women before her guys i don't even mean like before he met her but like even in the course of the relationship frederick leonard had other women which peggy Ovire clearly stated but guys my problem right now is the fact that netizens are taking this matter too too serious they are taking this too deep and i don't think it is healthy enough for this newly wedded couples i must tell you for a fact whether he had 10 women in the course of their seven years relationship or he had 20 or 50 no matter the amount guys should that even be our problem bottom line is that he has gotten married to opegi ovire and they are enjoying their marriage I don't see any reason why people have to now hold Peggy by that. Guys, a lot of persons even castigating and talking down on Peggy Ovira. Hmm, my dear, even the one that they said stay faithful with them, did not even marry them at the end of the day. Yes, so whether he's cheated on her in the course of their seven years relationship or not, my dear, that is the man that Peggy wants. That is her choice. 
let's not come and choose for peggy of you if really you want to come and choose for her beg go and meet people like judy austin and choose for judy austin and tell judy austin to leave your edoche alone and leave peggy out of this peggy just started her marriage yes it may be that she has talked too much or opened too much for someone who just got married i mean a lot of persons are saying what if he did not get married to her at the end of the day will she even have mouth to talk yes but since he got married to her she she can't get the mouth to talk now so let her talk i know then it's a bit too much for someone who hasn't even seen anything in marriage yet take a look at me edoche and y'all edoche those people are 17 years in marriage so we should even leave conversations like this for people like me edoche and y'all edoche do you understand instead of you just being 24 hours married and you are already talking about how girls should stay with a man no matter what whether he is poor stay with him he will definitely blow and all please i mean it worked for her yes but then again it may not work for everybody so i think the best thing should be oh if you know a man that has vision and all be patient with him because last last not be everybody way poor go reach you. There are people that are born poor, grow poor, they will marry poor and die poor. So let's not also pressure people to stay with a poor man, a broke man. Everybody should do what's what what works for them. Take a look at um DJ Copy, Temi uh, Femi Otedola's daughter. She's a very wealthy girl, married, born into a wealthy family, and still married a wealthy man. I beg, it's not only poor men that can love and be faithful to you and will keep you and treat you right. No, there are a lot of poor men who turn out to be rich and they treat their wife like trash. Example, your Edoche. Your Edoche who had absolutely nothing. But May Edoche, irrespective of her very rich background, she still had to stay with your Edoche. Only for her to find out that seven, 10 years out of 17 years in their marriage, your Edoche has been cheating on her with another man's wife. In fact, he has been in a devoted relationship with another man's wife for 10 solid years out of 17 years in their marriage. So I think, yes, Peggy Ovira is so happy and excited, but she should just blow the trumpet really, really small. Yes, make sure they allow the thing for people here because I am 100% certain a lot of persons are not even finding that statement funny, especially from their different experiences about relationship and marriage. And you just getting married today and you're already telling them, stay with him, he will blow. Hello, no be everybody way poor go rich, yo. Yes, no be everybody. There are some persons that will still remain at the level they are. As a matter of fact, they are some that will even make it and they will dump you, they won't treat you right after everything you've do, done for them. Let's tr- stop trying to apportion blame there are people who are just naturally like naturally like that no matter how good you are to them they will never pay you with good we can all attest to that even from our friends you have friends that you are so good to you treat them well and all but guys at the end of the day these people will still show you pepe they will still show you shaggy they will still betray you as a friend hide opportunities from you so guys let's forget about all it this thing does not even just relate to marriage alone it also relates to our relationship with everybody our friendship with people there are still people who don't know how to just pay good for good if no matter how kind you are to them no matter how much you help them they will still be bad to you even our savior jesus christ even jesus christ in as much as he lived a good life on earth he didn't hurt people he didn't try to make trouble and all i didn't know people who still does not like jesus christ who still hates him so much so please please let's just calm down with that whole sticking to a man no matter what if he's poor not all of them will grow to be something a lot of them will grow to be something take care of you that is your luck but do not force it do not try to choke it down on other people because a lot of young girls have seen shege in the house of men a lot of young girls have stayed with men at the end of the day they grow and they just treat you like trash so guys tell me what you think about peggy of various statements down below in the comment section and if you are yet to subscribe to this channel g central kindly subscribe right now to g central and turn on your post notification by smashing the bell button down below also follow us on facebook at g central and do not forget to do us a huge favor by sharing our video on all of your various social media platforms especially your facebook groups thank you guys so much for staying tuned to g central and see you soon Bye bye